It was during a formal cabinet meeting at State House Nairobi, chaired by President Uhuru Kenyatta, that the issue of renewal of land leases in urban areas became a matter of concern following increasing cases of cartels going after property whose leases have expired. In the meeting, the Interior Cabinet Secretary was immediately tasked to ensure the cartels are arrested and prosecuted. Equally, the Cabinet Secretary for Lands and Physical Planning was ordered to hold any further processing of leases until the system is streamlined to ensure that first priority in the renewal of leases is given to those occupying the land and in the event that they do not wish to renew the land in question, the land then be reverted to the government. And today, NLC Chairman Dr. Mohamed Swazuri moved in to save one such victim of the seed cartels in Nairobi's Ngara area. It would appear that the purported owner, who is not even mentioned except this is just the lawyer who says, my client, my client, has managed to get a forged or a fake lease document, which a copy we have here. Suzuri assured all and lease owners that their properties were safe and no crocs will take advantage of the expiry of the leases. Any lease prepared, issued by an agency other than the National Land Commission is illegal, null and void. And we are repeating that. We are also warning those people who are doing this because now it is a trend. This is the third structure we have come to see. There's the one that was demolished by the Kurji family. There's another one in Peponi Road, which we saved last Friday. And this is the third one now. It appears there is a, a, a systematic way of doing these things. So we are warning that gang that is doing that, that the law will not allow that.